Hello everybody. Today I'm gonna show you how to make a, a 360 art and crafts table that'll turn, you know, kind of like a lazy Susan. And uh, I had done thought about this and I was gonna build this round just because it's that kind of a thing, I reckon. But you don't necessarily have to build it round. And I was kind of thinking I wanted mine square, but anyway, you can do it whichever way you want to do it. And here's the secret right here. Look at that right here. That's a, a bar stool swivel. Now, if you want this countertop like I got, you might have to buy that. You know, somebody had give that to me. But I was going to make it. I was planning on making it out of this right here and, and uh I got out and picked it up this morning, it warped. And sometimes that matters, you know. Sometimes it matters. Now, if you want to make yours round, that's all right. Put your nail in the center of your table and figure out every how much you, every how big a circle you want. I seen my uncle do this one down about 16. I was amazed. <laughs> but uh, he was smart. But anyway, I got a little piece of wire here and I got a loop in it. I'm going to just stick my uh, marker in here and just draw a round circle. You know, take your time. Everything I do, I take my time. I don't I don't get in no hurry. But anyway, uh, you, you uh, do your circle. And let me tell you, you also can, I might have said this, you also can do your circle. And then make you a bigger square to go on top of it, and you can swap them out and stuff like that. I was going to show you this right here, but my jig, I just found out my jigsaw's broke. I had to let uh, somebody borrow it, my son. But uh, I can't put a blade in there. But anyway, I'm sure I'm talking down to a bunch of everybody even talking about this anyway. Just uh, cut this out. This right here is what you cut round circles out with, and it's... Uh, th there's there's hardly nothing better than this right here for doing this. We, okay, we have to have a couple of these pieces. And let me say that this has to be, you know, put this together in the right order. But what I'm going to do is, is I'm going to uh, just look at it and guess. Uh, that's about a half inch over there. That's about a half inch in, so I'm just going to mark it just like this. And I'm going to... I'm gonna cut me two. I'm gonna cut me two of these out. This I was cutting off of. It ain't square, but it don't matter. I didn't know. I didn't notice it till now. Look how crooked that right, right there is. <laughs> but it don't matter. So I'm gonna cut two of these. Tell you, your little pieces has got to go on first. And I did square them. I did square them some up some. And let me say that if you want to put screw a hole and put a bolt nut through it, you can. I don't think it's necessary for this. If if I thought it was, I would do it. And if you was going to do that, go ahead and put both pieces on. Now, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to just uh, center this up like with my eyeballs. Because, listen, y'all, this thing, it don't have to be perfect. If, if, if it did, if it, if it had to be perfect, perfect what the way I would do it. And this is these. These are some self-tapping screws. And i tell you what I'll do. I'll put two in. Make sure that's lined up. I'll show you what I'm talking about. I'm going to put two of them in. I'm going to turn it over. And I'm going to put, uh, put this on. Flip it back. Because I want it to be done from the bottom side, you know. And I'm going to put some longer screws in this. How about that? Okay, I'm kind of backtracking. I missed this filming a while ago. I don't know how I missed it, but I missed it. I'm going to show you how to center something up. Now, that same uncle I had, 
I seen him do this before when I was young. I'm going to put this, this in on zero. And then I'm going to turn this until it hits an even number. Can you see that? I'm, I'm turning this until it hits an even number. And I'm, see, me, see me get it right on 28? I got zero on one end and 28 on this end. That's just kind of key. That's just kind of a shortcut to, uh, to find the center or something. And then you see that I had done mark this right here. But anyway, you do the same thing for for the other end. Uh, you know the same same thing I just showed you. That's like I say. That's just a little quick way to do something. I also seen a while ago. I didn't show you the the uh, jigsaw. That's it right there. And I also want to backtrack and, and show you this right here. I, I don't. I, I missed it a while ago too. But I put some longer screws in this. There they are right there. And well, I left them too. But anyway, I need to go back and put these in there. You know, this is the first one I built. So you'll be an expert whenever you do yours. All right. See this right here is is six and a quarter so uh half of that's uh three and an eighth so i'm gonna uh lay this on three and an eighth you know this way and then uh and i'm gonna mark this uh on that end and then i'm gonna mark six and a quarter this way and you do the same thing this way Hey y'all, I ain't no beginner at YouTube. I got another channel. I just uh and then take this right here and you can square it up if you want to. Anyway, what I was saying is I got another channel, but I got so many videos and stuff they were starting to clash together and stuff. Alright, now that you got that, you just simply uh, put it on the marks. Okay, and then I'm going to take this and turn it. Man, that turns easy. See, now you can put your screws in. You know, I was going over the video, and I realized that I was saying, you know, it don't matter a lot. But this actually don't matter a lot. And... Uh, if you want to see something that does matter, you go look at the video where I was talking about building the wheelchair ramp in porch on this channel. And then you'll see, like, what matters to me. Now, this right here is, really it could stand to use a plate up under here. But I don't think it matters. You know, I mean, this... <laughs> This thing ain't high RPM. It ain't uh, nothing. I'm going to screw it down. And finally get fit to get take a look at this. Old piece here. <laughs> Man, it's out of square pretty bad, but this thing is just turning by hand, you know. And let me show you. Let me show you. You see how much what I was talking about matters don't matter? Alright, now let me let me show you the next step now. I got a stool here that I, I've had out here. Uh, <laughs> just like being in the way more than this doing good. But you can use anything you want. You can put it on the tabletop. See, I, I don't even know that I'll leave it on this stool. But I'm going to put this stool here. And now you see what the block of wood was for. And, uh... But 
You can put this on whatever you want to put it on. How about that? I say, I don't know if I'll leave it on this. Well, look at that. But take a look at that. How about that now? How about that? See, I told you it didn't matter. Uh, but, you know, this right here, you can do this any kind of way you want to do it. And the swivel that I bought, they's, they make a bunch of different kinds. Uh, yeah, i seen all kinds. i seen all kinds on there. But y'all get ready for me. I'm fixing to start making some arts and crafts.